Hello, today on Foraging for Balance, we're gonna do a short but sweet warm-up sequence that'll get you ready for your day or whatever else you have planned. All right, so I want you to find yourself at the top of your mat, standing with feet hip width apart, nice and tall, reaching through the crown of your head. Arms can relax near your sides or you can bring palms facing forward to help open the chest. Let's start by just closing the eyes and taking a few deep breaths here. Right, now let's visualize whatever it is you're warming up for, whether it's just your day-to-day -day activities, or maybe you have something fun planned for after this, All right? Picture yourself achieving whatever it is you're setting out to do today. All right, let's open up the eyes. Inhale, sweep arms up overhead, and gaze up at your hands. So you reach nice and tall. And let's bring palms together down past our heart as we fold it forward. All right. So here we are in our standing forward fold, feeling the length in the back of your legs. Maybe bend your knees if you're really, really tight. Let's inhale, lift halfway. We want to have kind of a 90 degree bend between our body and our legs. As we reach the crown of your head away from your bum. A lot of spine lengthening happening today. And then let's bend the knees, fold it forward, plant your hands on the mat, and hop, step, or walk your feet back to find yourself in a plank. So on shoulders over wrists, body nice and long, no booties in the air, no booties drooping down. If you need to, you can always drop your knees to the mat and do a kneeling plank. Strengthening the core, getting those muscles invigorated. Let's send our hips up and back now to downward facing dog. Press that mat away, lift the hips, lengthen the spine, and then try to reach your heels toward the mat. It does not matter if they get there or not. And let's drop our knees to the mat, coming on to all fours. Untuck your toes, make sure everything's stacked really nicely. Then we'll do a little balancing core work here. Inhale, reach your right hand forward, left leg back. Exhale, bring them back to the, to the mat. Inhale, left hand, right foot. Exhale, bring them to the mat. So you want to keep your core really tight as you go from side to side so that you don't tip over like I was doing earlier. Finish up the round that you're on. We'll come back to all fours. We're going to go into supported side plank. I want you to take your right foot, kick it out to the right side of your mat. Now roll onto your left foot, extending that leg behind you, supported in the upper body by the right hand on the mat, left hand toward the ceiling. And an option here to extend that bottom leg if you want to go full side plank rather than supported. All right, let's all come back to supported if we're not there. And we're going to reverse everything to come back on all fours. So bring left hand down, left knee comes in, right leg rotates back underneath you. And then we'll take it to the other side. So kick that left foot out to the left side. Don't hit the wall. Roll open, 
extend that right leg, right hand to the ceiling this time. Again, option to extend that bottom leg. If we really want to challenge ourselves in this warm up. And let's reverse it back to our tabletop. And then sit hips back to heels, finding child's pose. Maybe reaching those arms long if you want a little shoulder stretch. Or tucking hands under head as a pillow if you don't need that shoulder stretch. Let's inhale, bring that torso up. We're going to sit to one side, swing the legs around in front of you. And we're going to roll onto our backs. Let's bring knees into the chest. Give them a little hug. Maybe rock side to side. And let's do a little circling. And reverse your circles. Last one, find some stillness. Let's release feet down to the mat. Option, take your feet wide and let your knees fall together in constructive rest or extend nice and long arms at your sides for a Shavasana. Now this is our short and sweet session, so Shavasana will also be, also be short and sweet. Let's close the eyes, feel yourself relax into the mat. Become more and more relaxed with every breath. Go back to your visualization of what you are warming up for today, whatever it is you'd like to accomplish. See yourself achieving that goal, whether it's doing a load of laundry or writing a novel. And then let's bend our knees, bringing feet flat on the floor. And make your way up to a comfortable seated position. From here, let's seal this sweet little practice. Taking arms out to the sides, palms up. Inhale, scooping up all the goodness, all your good intentions. Let's bring it down to your heart. I wish you peace, love, and a productive day doing whatever it is you chose to warm up for. Thank you. All right, I hope you enjoyed that short little session and that you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.